Tony Ann White, age at this time unknown, gunned down December 10th, 2023, in Clinton, North Carolina, by her husband. Um, what can you say? This type of violence continues to happen. God bless the victim and family. Deputies are calling a murder-suicide. Family members identified the woman as Tony Ann White. Only on WREL, White's ex-husband spoke with WREL's Julian Grace. And Julian, you're learning that she warned her son not to come to the house. Ladies, if you are dealing with domestic violence, get out. It usually does not get better. It gets worse. Get your kids and get out now. did what mothers do, right? Protect their children at all costs. And now her ex-husband is speaking out tonight, saying more needs to be done to protect victims of domestic violence. Domestic violence, just don't do it. Ladies, get out now. On Saturday night, Tony Ann White sent out a text to her 19-year-old son telling him don't come home because her husband was upset. Then came Sunday morning, and the 19-year-old arrived to the house to find the bodies of his mother and stepfather. The Sampson County Sheriff's Office is calling it a murder-suicide. No kid, should, anybody should ever find somebody that they love in a position like in something like this. That's White's ex-husband, Joseph Salentino. He says his former wife was a great mom who always looked out for the best interests of their two sons. She was a good mother. There was, you know, she was always there for her kids. You know, she was always there, and she was a good mom for them both. Um, you know, when we were together, she had birthday parties, whatever. She, you know, she was always a mom. As we sat and talked, he shared White suffered abuse from her husband. She even pressed charges, only to drop them later by not showing up to court. I think women and men, whatever it is, um, they don't. Some of them are afraid to come forward, and some of them are afraid to say things. So I think they need more of the police to advocate for them. Is there enough being done to protect victims of domestic violence? I think um, things are improving, but uh, there's definitely a lot more work to do. Um, I think there needs to be a lot more um, resources available. Damian Talley with the Durham Crisis Response Center is on the front lines of helping victims of domestic violence. He says agencies will help victims develop a safety plan to get them out of an abusive relationship. And Salentino firmly believes that his ex-wife was on that path of trying to find a way to get out. She wanted to get away. She was trying to you know, better herself and, and get into a, a better place you know, and be happy again. As you heard Damian Talley state, there are a number of crisis centers in Durham and the Triangle here in Wake County like Interact. If you're facing domestic violence, there is help, help to help you develop an exit strategy to get out of that relationship. God bless Tony Ann White, gunned down December 10th, 2023 in Clinton, North Carolina in a domestic violence, murder, suicide. God bless the family. Dang. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.